With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Here, the question is, Mohit borrowed a certain sum at 5% per annum compound interest and cleared this loan by paying rupees 12,600 at the end of first year and rupees 17,640 at the end of the second year. Find the sum that he borrowed, right? So here we have given here as the question says that Mohit borrowed a certain sum at 5% per annum. This means here we are having rate R that is equals to 5% compound interest and cleared this loan by paying 12,000. Let me write here by paying 12,600 at the end of first year. So 12,600 at the end of first year. First year and rupees 17,640 at the end of second year, right? And we have to find that what what is the sum that he borrowed. So, we know that there is a formula that is A is equals to P into 1 plus R by 100 whole raised to power T with this T is time, R is rate, P is principal amount and A is amount. So, here you can see that as the question says that cleared his loan by paying rupees 12,600 at the end of first year. So we can say that here the amount is 12,600 and this equals to P where P is the principal amount into 1 plus here we have given the rate of interest that is 5 so it is 5 by 100 and here it is also given that the compound interest and cleared this loan by paying rupees 12,000 at the end of first year. This means in first here in this case we are having a time period of 1 year so here at place of this t we can write 1 now from here let's find this p so we can write this p as p is equals to here this 5 get cancelled with this 100 at 20 so it is 1 2 6 double 0 and this will become 20 plus 1 that is 21 by 20 so here it is multiplied with 20 and divided by 21 right and if we solve this from here, then we can write that we are getting P is equals to 12,000, right? So, now for the second year, for second year as by using this formula that is A is equals to P into 1 plus R by 100 whole raised to power T, here the amount in second year is 17,640, so it is 17,640 and this equals to, here the amount is P, P is the principal amount. 1 plus r by 100 that is 5 by 100 and by solving 5 by 100 it is 1 by 20 so 1 by 20 whole raised to power here again 1 because the question says that and rupees 17 at the end of second year that means from from end of first year to end of second year the time period is 1 year so t is equals to 1 year so here now from here we can say that the value of p is equals to 17640 into this 20 plus 1 that is 21 so 20 divided by 21 right and if we solve from here then we can say that here the principal amount comes is 168 let me correct here 16800 that means 16000 16800 right so from from first case that is in first year the principal amount is 12000 and from second case we get the principal amount is 16800 so as the question says find the sum that he borrowed so we can see that the sum that he borrowed is for first case it is 12,000 and for second case it is 16,800 so we can see that here this is the sum that he borrowed which is equals to 12,000 plus 16,800 that that is 28,800 rupees and hence we can say that this is our final answer thank you for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.